Hello, this is Dr. Ben Finio along with Cookie Monsters, Stegosaurus, and Mr. Googles here with a new tutorial about multiple simultaneous screen sharing in Zoom. Whereas previously, Zoom would only let one participant share their screen at a time, a new update allows multiple participants to share their screens simultaneously and lets each other participant toggle which shared screen they are viewing. Now, I do have an earlier tutorial that is all about the share screen function, so if you're not familiar with how to share your screen at all in Zoom, you should watch that first. You can find a link in the description. So, assuming you're comfortable with sharing your screen, you can enable the multiple screen share option by going down to the share screen button and clicking the little up arrow next to it. When you do that, you'll find that you can select an option for one participant can share at a time, or multiple participants can share simultaneously. So if you want multiple people to be able to share their screens at once, you need to select that second option. You'll notice that there is also a link for advanced sharing options here. You can click that, where again, you can toggle between the one participant at a time option or the multiple participants option. If you select one participant at a time, then there are some other options about whether only the host or all participants can share. But if you select the multiple participants option, it's going to gray those out and automatically let all participants in the meeting share their screens. So let's see what that looks like on my screen when Cookie Monster and Stegosaurus both share their screens at the same time. So you can see Cookie Monster is sharing his screen. My view is now in side-by-side -side mode where I can click and drag to resize the shared content versus the gallery view. If I want to turn that off, I go up here to view options and unselect side-by-side -side mode. That will put the shared screen here and show everybody across the top. If I want to toggle between the screens that are being shared, again, I go up to view options, select the drop-down menu, and select the screen I want to view. So if I want to see Stegosaurus instead of Cookie Monster, I just click Stegosaurus, and that will switch me to his screen. Now, what if you're one of the people doing the sharing, whereas previously Zoom would have stopped someone new from sharing their screen because only one person can do it at a time. Now, I still have the share screen option available. I can click share screen, for example, select my PowerPoint file, hit share, and now I see my own shared screen, but you notice I have lost the option to view the other screen. So it looks like while you are sharing your own, I no longer have an option up here to select Cookie Monster or Stegosaurus's shared screens. I can still see their thumbnails in this little floating window, but again, if you are sharing your own screen, you lose the ability to see the other screens that are being shared. Now, you may have noticed when I was clicking through the options earlier that the advanced sharing options mention that dual monitors are recommended for this multiple participant sharing. If you do have two monitors and the two monitor option enabled, that will allow you to see two shared screens at once instead of just making you toggle between them and only seeing one at a time. So let's take a look at that next. So now I am recording in dual monitor mode. If you're not familiar with that, again, I have an entire video about dual monitor mode in the playlist linked in the description. But now I have two zoom windows, one on each monitor, and I can toggle between the shared screens in each one of those independently. So this does allow me to see two screens at once, or for some reason, if I wanted to see the same screen twice, I could do that. So here I have Stegosaurus on both my left and my right monitors, but I can toggle either one of these between Cookie Monster and Stegosaurus by going up to View Options because I now have that control on each monitor. This also allows me to share my own screen and see my own shared screen in addition to one of the other shared screens. So I still can't see all three at once, but now I can go down to the Share Screen button, select my own PowerPoint presentation, click Share, and now I will see my own PowerPoint that I'm sharing on my left monitor. I can go into presentation mode here, and I can toggle between Cookie Monster and Stegosaurus on my right monitor. So as always, I hope you found that useful. I do have a playlist with a ton of other Zoom tutorials in the description. If you have a question or a suggestion for another tutorial, please leave a comment below this video. Thank you.